saying, America? We ain't free no more. <laughs> Can't raise no animals, take no wives. All I did was graze my livestock. Married them that needed marrying, and killed any that tried to stop it. I ain't wrong. <laughs> it's you that's wrong. We was trying to live free. You came along and laid... Twice. Take me in, just take me to the jailhouse. You know, you ain't going to court. You ain't going to jail either. I'm taking you to a professor I know. What in hell are you talking about? Lucky man, mister. You get to be part of a great experiment. Shut up! Huh? You ain't gonna die needlessly is what I mean. Nope. Your death's gonna be an uh, important step in the advancement of human knowledge. What in hell are you saying, mister? This professor, Andrew Bell III, I believe he said. He's a little odd, maybe harebrained, but I got no reason to doubt the quality of his work. What's this damn professor got to do with anything? Well, he wants to try this new electricity chair on you to kill you. You mean? No! Yeah. Well, he's gonna strap you into this contraption and run a large electric current through your system. Got something to do with moonshine. Don't quite know what. <laughs> I guess that's why he's the professor and I'm the bounty catcher. <laughs> well, as I said, I can pass on his assurances that this is a most humane way to go. It'll be just like, well, like switching off a light. <laughs> they wouldn't let you do this to me. They wouldn't. Oh, they would. And we got a permit and everything. You was in animal husbandry, am I right? Well, you ever seen lightning strike livestock, Mr. McDaniels? I ain't ever seen the actual impact. But I came across the pasture sometime after. The storm had just cleared and there was smoke in the air. Smell of burning hair. No. There must have been a dozen head of cattle. Lying there, piled up, mangled. Strange scars across their backs, legs, and necks. It's half like they was burned, half like the skin was ripped off. No! Eyes bleeding. Some of them popped out. No! If I hadn't seen the storm, well, I would have thought some devil caused that mischief. But, no, sir. It was light. Electricity does something all right. I seen trees explode in front of me. I seen desert sand baked into glass. That's what I seen lightning do. But, you know, hey, this electricity professor's got a plan for you. Ah, oh, that must be of an entirely different kind. <laughs> McDaniels, you all right? <laughs> uh-huh, me too. Well, you'll be happy to know we ain't got far to go. Hold on tight now. <laughs> Thank you. 
professor will be real pleased to meet you. <gasps> no! Here, I got him. You're wonderful. Just, just wonderful. Come on. Don't be shy now. Let's go. <clears throat> What are you waiting for? Que demonios? Come on, ah, uh, let me get a look at. Now where's my money? Um, money? Yeah, for all the running around I've been doing. Uh, oh, well, one stay by my humane electric ending facilitator. There'll be money enough for you, sir. Yeah, let's hope. All right, let's get our, our, um, our poor unfortunate ready for the demonstration. Oh, do come and watch. It'll be amazing. Come along.